We are on our way to the Austin station. Heading to time of our lives. Quite an interesting conversation back on the aisle, right, right, Danny? Fuck yeah. What? <laughs> All right. Pretty interesting conversation with a bunch of people on the aisle. A lot of arguing on there. And there's the Wells Tower. King of all giants, Willis Tower and the 411 Wacker Drive building, also known as the Crown Building. And we got ourselves a seagull, as typical in Chicago. These are the elevators that will be taking us to the 103rd floor. Watch as we pass by some of the tallest buildings, monuments, and structures in the world. Soon you'll be enjoying what we like to think of as the best view in the world. On a clear day, you can see for miles and into four neighboring states. And be sure to check out the ledge, four glass balconies that extend out from the west edge of the sky deck and make you feel like you're walking in midair, oh, 103 ears. stories above Wacker Drive and the Chicago River. You're riding up this 1,450-foot modern marble in one of the tower's 104 elevator cars. Your trip to the sky deck will only take about a minute and a half. That means your elevator is traveling at a speed of more than 16 feet per second. The tower opened its doors in 1973 and held the title of the world's tallest building for 25 years. The West Antenna reaches 1,730 feet above the Chicago streets. We're now passing 850 feet in San Francisco's Transamerica Pyramid, 970 feet in the Yokohama Landmark Tower, Japan's tallest building, 1,062 feet in Paris's stunning Eiffel Tower, completed in 1889, 1,205 feet in the Bank of China Tower in Hong Kong, 1,250 feet in the Empire State Building in New York. And now we're here, 103 stories up. Welcome to the top. I look like toy cars. When I was a little kid back in 1997, before they had the Sky Deck Glass platform, all you had to do was look down and look at the cars. They look like toy cars. Let's see if we can find any toy cars. Yep. A couple toy cars. A lot of parked cars. Pretty hazy in the in the distance. Thank you. 
Skydeck Ledge. When I first got here, uh, it was crowded. You were not able to have pictures up there no more. It was really hard to get a picture out of it. And they changed up now so they have pictures. Looks like uh, today will be, I mean that part will be if you want to pay for more pictures. Let's try some somewhere else. After getting slightly lost trying to find this building, we finally found it by sheer dumb luck. Now we got ourselves an old church right here, covered in vines. Great thing about this building, it's got a Best Buy. How cool is that? A Best Buy, right next, right on the base of a skyscraper. Officially gonna go to the to the 
Well, first we'll go to uh, the Chicago Skywalk entrance, whatever that is. And we'll visit the tilt, which is a platform of glass that, that tilts, tilts you 30 degrees downward. It's gonna be awesome. All right, let's see what this is. Nothing but a screen. <laughs> it's impressive up here, isn't it? Yeah, it's windy. Nothing, no glass, just a screen. Here's the tilt. It's a window platform that tilts you 30 degrees downward, making you a, giving you a feeling of free fall. Well, we just went on the tilt, and uh, my experience there is that, well, it was interesting, but you know, scary slightly but it wasn't entirely that scary it'd probably be even more scarier if it if it tilted 45 degrees I'd be even scarier well hope you all liked the video be sure to subscribe and I'll see you on the next time peace out everybody